Oh, uh, Jacob, so your thoughts? Man, that's a 50-50 to me. We're about to do an interview, man. Can you guys do that? Yeah, go ahead. That's, that's a 50-50 to me, man. Oh, Con and Crawford? No, Canelo and, and um, Jacob. That's so 50, how, 50. How, how does it play out, you feel? I see, man, listen, they both got nice body shots. Canelo, like, coming up, under, and over. Mm -hmm. And Danny Jacob did the same, so that's a good fight for both of them. I, I call that 50-50 down the middle. If, if whoever shows up that night, whoever's mm -hmm. feeling themselves. How, how, how would, obviously, Jacobs has the height advantage, obviously, kind of like a bigger guy. Yeah, how would Canelo, you? Canelo, Canelo. Canelo's not a little, Canelo's a heavy boom. Canelo's one of them guys, like, he, he's a heavy boom guy. So he's like one of them little husky guys. That, mm. Like a house so kind of. Little guy. Yeah, right. Canelo's a big boom. That's what you call a big boom person. Right. A person is heavy on bone. Like right. He's heavy, big neck. If you're training Jacobs, because I feel like, well, you said 50-50. You're one of the few that, yeah. that says that. I, I get oh, yeah. a lot of people saying it's a very close fight, yeah. but they tend to favor Canelo. Yeah, because Canelo's a bigger star. Mm. That's so I guess how would you train either guy for well, the other person's if, if style? I, if I was to train um, uh, Canelo, I would have Canelo jab a little bit and, and, and try to, like, come on the inside and keep Danny Jacobs on because Danny Jacobs longer. So I will keep Canelo coming in the inside. Canelo's good in there. He's good in there. Dip and slip in because he can stand there and swip on him like this. And then Danny Jacob, I would just try to box a little bit, use his height, run a little bit, grab Canelo, frustrate him. That's what I would have him do. And Triple G signed with the zone, one of the apps you were talking yeah. about. I feel like the goal is to have the third fight with Canelo, Triple G. Yeah, but who wants to watch that? I mean, the Not fans, you? The fans want to watch that. He already had a draw and then he beat him. What's behind that? Do you you, you don't feel like because I feel boxing has a legacy of trilogies. No, you're right, but you're right. But what I'm saying is, it's more middleweights out there. There's a lot of middleweights out there that can fight Canelo after this. Why go back to if, if, if Triple G would have beat Canelo, he would have gotten a rematch. I think so. I, well, I only think so just because I feel that Canelo still has that. Is I mean, you can't beat the guy and Canelo take their don't place. Need him. Canelo need, they need him. Hmm? Canelo don't need none of them guys. Appreciate you, Angel. Thank you, man. <clears throat>